Hello everyone, SP Architects here today I will show you how to clean your wipe house when you export your ARCHICAD file to AutoCAD file. What are the wipe house? As you can see, we have some objects and if we move this object, you will see the yellow position is not changing, only we change object and with its fill type which is white. We are moving object lines and also the white hatch in AutoCAD of course in ARCHICAD it's called fill. We are moving the fill parts. When you export this file to AutoCAD it's going to try mimic your ARCHICAD drawing orders such as this yellow and white fills. But sometimes it causes problems and also it slows your AutoCAD and computer performance. And also you may encounter some visibility problems. Most of these border lines to cover your objects as in AutoCAD called as bypass. So in this tutorial we are going to clean them with the easiest way and how we can fix this. Alright, first of all let's start saving this file as AutoCAD. Let's go to file menu and click save as. After that we will locate our folder and from the settings we will change something. We will just select one of these name and click duplicate and rename it such as this DW export and most important thing I think is changing this save options. I prefer working in model space so I choose model space as save layout into. After that I prefer selecting this explode architect elements to simple lines. Or you can select other options but most efficient way is selecting explode architect elements or convert only objects to blocks. Okay, let's select let's try this to blocks and let's click save and save our file. Alright, here we are in AutoCAD and as you can see some objects are only lines. Some objects are blocks such as this tree or this chair and this table. If you can realize when I pan some heads are appearing. This is not correct and we have some performance problem when trying to zoom in and zooming out. It's not normal. This happens because there are some wipeout elements. Sometimes they can easily be selected or not. Let's try selecting them. We will go to quick selection and you will see object type. This is going to be wipeout. As you can see it's selectable. If you can see this you can try to explode your drawing and you will see this wipeout. Let's click this after that we will select select all. Now all of the wipe house will be selected. Let's click OK. And as you can see some elements are selected. And then we will just delete with E space. As you can see we erased 346 wipe house. Now our project is very fast. And I can easily pan. If you want to continue, you can delete the unnecessary field types. If you go to ARCHICAD, there is no field type such as that one. But AutoCAD is wrong. So to delete this, I will just select this type. This is a simple solid element. I can right click this and I can select and click this select similar and then I can easily delete this. Let's go back to alternative this you can click this quick selection and for the object type you will select this H and click pattern name this is going to be equal as 
solid. Now this is going to select all of the solid heads. We will select all of them and delete because there is no need to use solid heads in AutoCAD drawing. As you can see all of the solid heads are selected. I'm going to move them to here. Um, I will input here 500,000 and I will see which elements are going to be deleted. You can manipulate them from here by deleting with this style and you can move them back as same value. 500,000 and hit enter. Oops, try again. Just like that. Now we have fixed our AutoCAD drawing. By the way, you can check out your drawing scale. If you want to control your scale of your project, you can just click the linear dimension and you can compare your linear dimension with this value or instead of that you can only use a simple wall this wall is 10 cm only so it's going to be very easy from here to here is 5000 which is not correct we can fix this in ArchiKit or we can just scale it from here let's fix it in ArchiKit let's go to file menu click save as once again and it was the DWG export. Let's click settings. And if we select the drawing unit, um, let's change this value to 50. And simpler, this is going to be 1, and this is going to be 10. Now we can click the save and just overwrite this or give another name let's open our file and this is our new save file let's click linear and from here to here it's 10 which is correct and this was how you can fix your vital problems and how you can fix your scale problems when you export from ArchiCAD to AutoCAD and if you are serious about learning ArcGIS, you can go to my Patreon page. From there, I will be waiting for you. Alright, thank you for watching. Until next time, have a nice day. Bye.